This question is from NEET 2017 paper code Y. Question number 137. Question is consider a drop of rain of water mass 1 gram falling through a height of 1 kilometer. It hits the ground with a speed of 50 meters per second. Take G constant with a value of 10 meter per second square. The work done by first part gravitational force and second part resistive force of the air is. So we have to find out the work done by gravitational force and we have to find out the work done by the resistive force. So one by one let's find it. We know that work done work done by the gravity which is the gravitational force that will be basically mgh and when the raindrop is falling down mg is, is acting down and h is also down so force and displacement both are in the same direction so that's why the work is positive and it is going to be now what is the mass mass is 1 gram which is 10 to the power minus 3 kg and the value of g that we have to take is 10 so 10 into height is 1 kilometer which is 10 to the power 3 now this and this will get cancelled out and we will left with 10 joule work right so the work done by mg will be 10 joule without solving further you can just answer that since we have uh, the work done by the gravitational force that is 10 joule but if you will find out the work done by the resistive force that will also be the minus one point uh, minus 8.75 joule right so let's find out that also from the work energy theorem by work energy theorem work energy theorem we know that work done by all the forces that is kinetic energy final minus kinetic energy initial that means work done by mg plus work done by the resistive force so we have two things here that will be equal to kinetic energy final minus kinetic energy initial we know that work done by mg is 10 joule plus work done by resistive force that we have to find out that will be equal to kinetic energy final minus kinetic energy initial now what is the kinetic energy initial see it starts falling so its initial speed is 0 so kinetic energy initial will be 0 and kinetic energy final will be half mv square right so 10 plus work done by resistive force that will be half into 10 to the power minus 3 into v is 50 so it is 50 square so 50 into 50 right so this is 10 plus work done by resistive force will be equal to and uh, if you will calculate this it will be 1.25 right and if you will solve it further you will get work done by resistive force will be 1.25 minus of 10 that will give you minus 8.75 joule right so now we get the proper answer work done by mg is plus 10 joule work done by resistive force is minus 8.75 joule right so these are the two options that we have so let us check which option is correct option third this option is correct okay thank you